With the new runes revealed for phase 2, you can finally fulfill your deepest warlock fantasies of your dreams in Season of Discovery. Be the demon subjugator with Felicard, or almost like demon hunter sensation from Warcraft 3 with Immolation Aura and Metamorphosis. Also, the oldie, Affliction, is getting huge spells and buffs. All in all, it seems you can streamroll your way through instances no matter how you wanna play them. The possibilities are endless and new specs and talent combos will be rising all throughout phase 2. I am quite positive no one can say right now for 100% certainty what will be the best in slot spec for phase 2. But of course, as a player and as a community, we wanna feast with our thoughts about the different options and combos. I am quite sure Warlock Metatanks will be a great or THE pick for AoE Scarlet Monastery farming with bunch of mages or other good AoE classes. Combined with Shaman Earth Shield or Paladin Concentration Aura, it will be insane. I'm really into researching this AoE tanking in phase 2 and will keep you updated on that, so hit that sub button to get more info in the future. Now I'm gonna throw out there fast a couple of specs that I have been thinking for Warlock meta tanks, but how well everything will work in practice remains to be seen when we get to actually play them. First, the AoE master for dungeon group play. Think of this, pop up emulation aura, cast incinerate 25% fire buff, drop down lake of fire with instant tick of rain of fire to get also 40% fire buff, cast shadow flame to get the initial aggro, then smack the shit out of your hellfire button, Stun everyone, daze everyone, make insane damage, and see mob packs of like 10 to 20 mobs or even more melt around you. I don't think you even need conflagrate here, but of course it needs to be tested. And actually, you can combine this with firestone, so some use of that spell at least also. Now to the second spec. How about solo self heal drain life monster? This spec we are going deep affliction and enhance our drain life capabilities. With this spec you are tossing dots everywhere and all who come in melee will get the emulation aura damage. Also, I chose runes that boost spell damage and healing to elevate siphon life and most important drain life's healing to the maximum. Dark pact is kinda whatever but surely it will reduce couple of life taps while you're fighting mobs. You can switch to dance of the wicked against hard hitting mobs or shadow flame for low HP high density packs. I am quite sure this will be fun in solo leveling, and you surely don't fall to sleep since you have a ton of buttons to press. How about we go on a trip with our Felguard buddy in open world or solo dungeons? I'm so glad this is here. Now what would be more fun than grab your favorite guy and go on a lighthearted road trip? This spec is greatly focused and also very dependent on your demon to be alive and kicking, and your soul link to be active. I'm quite positive Felgard will be making insane damage and stay alive pretty well with this and you as a tank will get another tank buddy to be controlled. Some talents here seem kinda not worth it on their own, but they're mandatory to get Soul Link. Soul Link with Felgard seems kinda insane and if your Felgard is going low, just toss in a new one with Fel Domination, because it is said that Felgards get all the talent benefits than other demon pets would get. This is also why I didn't bother with improved health funnel. The talent master demonologist won't say what it does with Felgard, but I believe it's the same as in TBC, so it will give you 5% more damage and 0.5 resistances per level when 5 out of 5 talents. Now do these 3 specs have room for improvement? Absolutely, but I believe they give you a great starting point and they show us the possibilities for very different playstyles as a meta warlock tank. Which of these specs appeal you the most? What kind of specs have you thought of yourself? Toss in a comment and a link to your liking. Now see you in phase 2 and hit that like, sub, peace!